Hi there, today I wanna to talk to you about some tips on how to attract your personal training clients. Because you might be out there qualified now and thinking, now what do I do? I wanna get some clients, go to their house or meet them in the park or whatever, and how do we actually get those clients to know that you're there? So think about who you are targeting, okay, first of all. Think about who you want to train, um, where you're gonna get them from, and not just like your local gym, you know, you're working in the gym, maybe on the gym floor, you're gonna to check to people, but maybe the type of people you want to target um, how old are they what do they do for a job what are their interests what are their goals think about all those things so that you can target them and what they actually are about so that you can resonate with them you can talk to them and you can relate to them on their level that way then you can get that rapport and they'll buy into you you'll buy into them and you'll have a great working relationship with them as well which will be good yeah because that's ultimately what we want we want to actually work with people that want to work with us so who are you targeting and target them based upon their interest for you as well think about a USP your unique selling point okay what what will you do that can stand out from the rest so how can how can you be different now this can be what you are interested in what you've achieved um, what you like doing so for example if you're already a runner a cyclist if you've done a marathon if you've climbed mountains if you've done things what have you achieved because you're likely to attract people that want to achieve that as well and you can use that you know if you're a mum or a parent and you want to work with people that are also parents and you can relate to them and the challenges they have with time for example um, you know relate to someone that's pregnant you know get your pre postnatal qualification but use those things to give you a unique selling point your interests things that you're good at as well that you're passionate about that people can really see that from you okay so have something create a niche that's what you want to do create a niche that you can actually use to uh, relate to people yeah that, that really is helpful now also once you do start training people to help you get more clients from then on build up some testimonials get some reviews get people to write down what they think of their training sessions what they've achieved because this is a great way to help you build up your own clientele get a portfolio of clients and it's a great way of word of mouth as well because those people have a great experience with you they'll achieve their goals um, and they're going to tell people and ultimately that's what you want okay in this industry word of mouth is key okay there's nothing better than having a recommendation so get some testimonials get people talking about you um, build up that portfolio and um, tell everyone just tell everyone all about it which then takes us on to social media Okay, social media is massive in the fitness industry. You probably know that already. Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, it's all there. It's easy, it's accessible, and it's relatively cheap. You don't have to pay to put these ads out there. You just gotta target the right people. Um, you just gotta put, make your posts readable, if you like. Make it so that people wanna read it. Give it free content, give them information, and then hook them in, and then you've got them coming back, yeah? So make it interesting, and make it so that they're gonna want to know what you've got to say. Try and help people, give a little bit away, tell them, um, if you like, what you can what you can do to help them, but leave it, keep a little bit back, yeah? So get yourself a Facebook page, an Instagram page, and really get out there and tell everyone what you're about and try and just kind of attract all these people because this is where your customers are. Your customers are on social media and people are loving it right now. So use it, use it. Uh, prioritize that, prioritize talking. Tell everybody what you do. If you're working in a gym, it's great. You get paid to talk to people. Use that opportunity. Wherever you are, tell everybody what you do. Okay, let be known the person in your area that can train people, that can help people achieve their goals, and that you can actually work with them to make their lifestyles so much better, achieve their goals, and give them an active, healthy lifestyle. You've just got to get used to bigging yourself up, really, and you can do that, you can believe in that. So prioritize talking, telling people, and really get yourself out there, okay? Target the right people, get yourself out there, tell the world you're there for them, okay? And it's all there for you. Comment below, let us know what you think. And um, if you need any more tips, just let us know. I can talk to you about some other things. And um, I look forward to speaking to you soon. Bye.